If you watch News Channel 15, you've seen us give mow casts, so it's only fitting that today for the green thumb, we get out in the lawn and talk about mowing. Today, I'm joined by Ricky Kemery. He's here with the Purdue Extension office, and we've actually got a new kind of push mower here. This thing is completely battery powered. It is, you know, and one of the issues that comes with gas powered lawn mower, mowers is, is that they are the number one polluter of air in the urban areas in Fort Wayne. One, really? one gas powered mower is like driving 11 cars for one hour. So, uh, one of the ways that folks can be more sustainable is to use these new battery powered mowers and they've come a long way since the early days when you had cords on them and and everything else it takes about uh, 15 or 20 minutes to charge that battery so it's not long at all and it'll cover probably about three or four thousand square foot of lawn so again it's not for everybody and quite honestly this cost just a little bit more than a regular gas powered mower. It's lighter than the average mower because you don't have that gas tank and everything else. Can we get a look at the underside of this just so folks see that I'm I'm curious myself what the blade setup looks like. Is it similar it's to very similar, what you yes. see on a standard? Yeah, this happens to be a 20 inch cutting width. You okay. can get wider ones. So the key fits right in here and then um, what you have to do is depress the key Oh, there we go. Okay. I don't know why I did that. People, uh, may, be, people may be asking, <laughs> is that it? That's all the sound it makes? That's yeah, it. Yeah. And since it mulches, you don't have any clippings. Very cool. Well, thanks so much for showing us the beauties, I guess we'll call it, of an electric push mower. You can use this whenever we give you MoCast here on Wayne TV. Remember, you can get all kinds of planting tips and yard tips from the Green Thumb tab on Wayne.com.